Sports. It's in the game.
verdade que se expande por inteiro Porque nunca se apartou da natureza um corpo só Livre tenho duas cabeças Como pássaro africano são portais Eu olho pra trás e reconheço o futuro Vincado no agora resplandece o amanhã Sou forte ainda como a folha da obra Que me seguia nunca erra a direção Sou uma árvore inteira de olhar atento e pé no chão Baoba! They said if we're serious geese, we were way past the fondness. Slumber through to a out in the deep, took the brunt of the boulder. Couldn't have something they couldn't see, made a mess of the border. With a new strain of a disease. Stark asymmetries Folded overnight Created something deep Tenfold in the light Heaven knows they're giving up The trepidation, hope of dust Emanate, take a break For better days, not fun of us Myself a beneficiary, more ideas in the cold room. Half the world is on hold overseas. What you believe till it's over. Stark asymmetry.
bad because you talk, talk, don't mean you sue. High energies, body head, top loops. I guide me, I don't follow no rules. I buy that, hold that got to the death for me. Snakes in the grass, grass scheme, and I'm trying to take off heads. Your weak, that's why you pray them teams. Self conscious, brother, you need to love yourself. For gliding, you know, gliding, 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 well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game? And who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. Monopoly starting 11. Well, it's a 4-3-3 with two out-and-out -out wingers, but they do vary their movement. They give width, but they also make diagonal runs in field when the ball's on the opposite flank. Their performances will be key today. The Inter starting lineup. Well, 3-5-2 is a great system if you can get control of the midfield because your wing-backs can then play higher up the pitch and the front two can combine as a pair, but they need to dominate that central area. And so the battle commences. Martinez. Keeper flings himself at the ball. Trying to deliver it accurately. And they deal with the threat this time. Yeah. 
A lot to like about Bologna. Well, the referee had to stop play, and he's doing that now so the player can receive treatment. Now back underway with a drop ball. But it was a difficult experience, a bad result for Inter in the last match against Sampdoria. What do you anticipate seeing this time, Stuart? Yes, it was a difficult game for them, losing 1-0 at home. Today, they just need to show a bit more ambition going forward. Then they'll get a better performance and a possible outcome. I think a draw is the most likely result. Oh, opportunity here, Stuart! And failed to keep himself onside, unfortunately. Christoph Baumgartner. A very good tackle. Well, he had to read it and get there, and did. Oh, a nice-looking pass. Oh, but brilliantly read to cut it out. It looked so promising. Well, Inter have it back now. He's got the right idea with that pass. And he's kept it out, fully stretched, somehow reaching it. Corner kick played in. Couldn't quite hang on. Well, he went strongly into the challenge, and the result is a throw-in. And they'll get ready for the throw-in. It's been well nigh impossible to escape all the news stories surrounding him ahead of the game. Well, perhaps a surprise to see him go straight into the starting 11 today, but I'm sure the fans were delighted. And it's a really poor challenge. Now, what's the referee going to do about it? Well, it was apparently a bookable offence. Well, no debate over that one. It's a yellow card all day long. Attending to his defensive chores. Christoph Baumgartner. Oh, moving it nicely. Precise ball movement. Well, honestly, I didn't mean to jinx them. Just... Oh, and that challenge carried with it quite the element of risk. Now, what's the referee going to do next? And the early shower. This is going to be a real test of their metal. Well, it's a straight red, and rightly so. But how will they replace him? They've got to reorganise now. Substitution time it is. That's the kind of shielding play you expect from him. Looking confident with the ball at his feet. Well, you can't blame him for taking it on, but lacking the accuracy required in the end. Goal kick here. Takes the shot. Well, flinging himself at it. Delivering it. Well, clattered away. Oh, good strike! Goodness gracious me! How about that for technique? You can't strike them much better than that! Well, as the replay shows us, this is the way to beat tight marking. Just look how he turns with the ball. That's a fantastic goal, you have to say. Will Napoli get the game restarted? Can they come up with an appropriate response? Inter in a position of menace. 
but nothing comes of it. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Tapsoba. And dispossessed. Well, the referee well aware that he had to blow his whistle. And on comes the physio. And so play will be restarted by means of a drop ball. Showing a lot of guile there. And a goal! That's his brace. They just can't keep him quiet. Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease. And it's just a change of pace. And the movement is good, making for a comfortable finish. It's a really great goal. Second goal for them here. And totaling up all the stoppages. We'll have two additional minutes. And they know they need to stop him. And he's through here. And it goes! A three-goal cushion. This is astonishing stuff. Well, let's look at this again. He's done superbly well to pick out a teammate here. And from there, he never looked like missing. That's a lovely goal. A chance then for the respective managers to address their charges. It is half-time here. He's got the right idea with that pass. And he's kept it out, fully stretched, somehow reaching it. And the ball is rolling once more. The pendulum having already swung Inter's way here. Let's see how the second half pans out. Carr. A decisive clearance it was. Well, closed down straight away. And the pass not quite accurate enough. And a throw in then. And given away. Can he put it away? A really top-notch piece of defending. A really intense pressure applied. Will he play it in? Splendid defending. Well, nicely cut out. Oh, my goodness! He's caught that so well! A goal of the highest class! Fantastic technique! Well, here's the replay, and you see it was a good finish. But the keeper at his near post has to do a lot better. He's got to have that near post cover for me. Away again, and this game was finished as a contest a long time ago. A real defensive.
sense of commitment there. In with a chance. Well, trying the chip, but he got the execution all wrong. Well, if he had the chance again, I think he'd choose another option. Not even close in the end. They will now make use of the substitute's bench. All the big channels have been going heavily on this particular story. Marcus Rashford could be on his way to Everton. Well, apparently they've now made an official bid for him. So we should know pretty soon where his future lies. And intercepted it. Inter with the ball once more. Will he find the net? What a block! Martinez. The cut back. And a tidy challenge. Such an important goalkeeping intervention under pressure. And a blunder by the keeper. And that's the hat trick! Tearing apart this defence time and again. They simply can't handle it. Well, here it is again, and you have to say, he looks so uncomfortable with the ball at his feet. He's cost his team a goal here. And he read it superbly. Now we have a plethora of live matches coming up for you here on EA TV. This one, I think, might pique your curiosity. I'm really looking forward to that. Two entertaining teams in what should be a really feisty affair. And no worries for the goalkeeper. Good defending to stop a decent real chance. Oh, there it is! It's one goal after another, and it speaks to the quality of that performance. Well, it's an out and out pasting 6 0. Superbly to take back possession. Could be dangerous. Well, tremendous block. Options in the middle. And a throw in forthcoming. Having won the ball back, they might be able to profit. And now it is truly final. The match is over. Well, no surprise to see who our cameras are focused on. All the hype and transfer drama aside, what did you make of his performance today? Well, you couldn't ask for much more from him, could you? Had a huge impact, particularly in front of goal, and he'll certainly have the fans excited after that performance. Takes the shot. Showing a lot of guile there.
Take my hand, follow me, follow me to a place, a place where we can be free. Follow me.
Well, what a game we have in store for you today. The hype has been building all week and the fans are pouring into the stadium. The tension palpable. Stay tuned. We'll have all the action for you live here on EA TV. Hello to you from Milan, a city synonymous with high fashion. The stadium might not be fashionable anymore, but it remains iconic, the San Siro. I'm Derek Ray, your match commentator, and alongside providing all the tactical and technical analysis, it's Stuart Robson. And the focus is very much on Serie A, the top division here in Italy. What do you anticipate seeing, Stuart? Well, thanks, Derek, as always. The scene is set, two good teams, a great playing surface and a vibrant atmosphere. It has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. Given away by Inter. A foul, but advantage played. It should be! And he clears it out of harm's way. Right, let's bring in Alex Scott, because Alex, I believe, has been a change to the scoreline in the Venezia game. It's a goal for Napoli. It's now 1-0. And he's through here. And a goal right off the bat. No wonder they're jumping for joy. Well, here's the replay, and you see it was a good finish. But the keeper at his near post has to do a lot better. He's got to have that near post cover for me. Well, unfortunately, we had to interrupt Alex just then. Just to confirm, Napoli have scored in that game. They now lead by one goal to nil. Well, couldn't quite. Chances on. Oh, moving it nicely. And it goes! Two goals in rapid fire fashion and looking very comfortable here. Here it is again, and I don't expect goalkeepers to save everything at their near post, but on this occasion, although it's a good strike, he should do better. So, 2-0 now. Robert. Well, there to intercept. Now a decent position. You can't help feeling when you look oh, at the. What a great chance this is, Derek. Going for the dink. Oh, and that is an audacious chip. Well, he might smile. The goalkeeper has no interest in smiling. Well, just look at this again. The speed of counter-attack is so impressive. And the chip requires such good technique. That's a brilliant bit of skill. What a goal. Well, and away they go again. And it's an undeniable fact. Inter are really... In the mood Zula has eyes for goal and the keeper stretching to deny him well news coming through of a penalty in one of the other matches and Alex Scott can fill us in yeah it was a penalty for Torino well he... he's in behind and a goal to seal the hat-trick a master class in finishing just can't stop. stop him today. Well, as you can see, what an excellent backfield this is to set up the goal. And then through on goal, and just goes for power and smashes it past the keeper. There's no stopping that. What a great finish. A lopsided contest. 4-0.
Nicolo Zaniolo. Myron Boadu. Well, lovely work to get past his man. Using his strength to shield the ball. Right, interesting news coming through from the Venezia game. Let's hear all about it from Alex. Yeah, it's a goal for Venezia. The score's level again now at 1-1 with 25 minutes on the clock. Many thanks as ever, Alex. And showing excellent vision. Well, not to be. He had moved into an illegal position. Well, it's great. that he wants to run in behind but he has to get the timing right car excellent refereeing advantage in operation he succeeds in clearing it this might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity Well, they no longer have the ball. Martinez. Carr. Intelligent threaded pass here. Oh, burying them beneath an avalanche of goals. No let up here. Well, here it is again, and it's a superbly weighted through ball to break that defensive line. But I think the keeper has made a mistake here. While it's a decent finish, it should go in at that near post. Blistering first half display, and just look at that score. Boadu Good technique displayed Element of risk there But he's won the ball And one minute of stoppage time Has been added on Nicolo Zaniolo. A chance then for the respective managers to address their charges. It is half time here. And he's through here. And a goal right off the bat. No wonder they're jumping for joy. And it goes! Two goals in rapid fire fashion and looking very comfortable here. Oh, what a great chance this is, Derek. Going for the tink. Oh, and that is an audacious chip. Well, he might smile. The goalkeeper has no interest. He's in behind. And a goal to seal the hat-trick. A masterclass in finishing. Just can't stop him. Car. Intelligent threaded pass here. Oh, burying them beneath an avalanche of goals. No let up here. now make use of the substitutes bench
Not a long ride, tell them better recognize gold when they see a G. Been reflecting, man, I know what they see in me. Made in his image, so I'm close to a deity. Raised on a block, though, still I've been hustling at this free of me. Big wave, rocking a boat like an Elias scene. Dark rings, getting no sleep, couldn't be a dream. <sighs> The cameras are fixed to one man. After four goals in his last match, what next? This is EA TV. And a warm welcome from a venue that really oozes football history. I'm talking, of course, about the San Siro in Milan. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me in the commentary position is the former Arsenal and West Ham midfield player, Stuart Robson. And what we have coming up for you is action from the round of 16. 